Hi, and thanks again for joining me. In this video, I'm showing how to prepare an engine block for a rebuild and how it went so, so wrong for me. This actually starts long ago, before I got a new camera. I pressure washed most of the gunk off the engine block and went ahead and cleaned the transmission before I rebuilt it. When I finally got around to working on this engine, the next step was to assemble the cam bearing puller. A small section of 1 and 3 quarter inch tube was perfect to knock out the rear machining cap. Now I just knock the bearings out one at a time. I realized it would have been easier to work from front to back, but for some reason I removed mine from back to front. And no, this isn't bathroom talk. I then found the least efficient way to remove the crank bearings. If you haven't noticed, I'm not a very experienced engine builder. Next I rolled the block out for one more cleaning. I concentrated on cleaning out the oil galleries and journals.
I'm also cleaning up my transfer case for an upcoming video here. When finished, soak the block down with WD-40 to wash away most of the water and leave a light film of oil. I use a sanding block with 100 grit sandpaper to even out the deck. Watch for any low spots that aren't being touched by sandpaper. I was pretty lucky and my deck already seemed nice and flat. Switch to 220 grit and wet sand with WD-40. Taking the block to a machine shop is an added cost, and overboring the cylinders will require new pistons. To save on some cost, I wanted to try and run a ball home through first. Move the hone in and out while the drill is running. This will etch the correct and even hone in the bore. There were some very minor vertical scratches in a few cylinders, but nothing very deep. I just had to run the hone some more to remove. The scratch marks were visible, but I couldn't feel them with my fingernail. This will be good enough for now. Now I just run through all the cylinders and inspect closely for damage that is not cleaning up.
everything was looking good, right up until I got to cylinder number two. See that little spot? I looked through all my footage to see if there's something I did that could have caused that damage, but I am stumped. I'm left to believe that there was an inclusion in the casting just under the surface that opened up. This is catastrophic. It seems too deep to be machined out, so this block is likely junk. So what now? You've probably seen a parts truck in the background outside. Do I pull this motor? Or do I track down another block? I have a plan brewing, but you'll have to see what in a later video. For now, thank you for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.